Today, we're going to build something that will help break through those awkward moments of not knowing what to do next in your world. And it's also a great way to add some fun and crazy challenges to the game. Stick around to the end because I've got some really fun ideas that you can use with this build. So what is this machine of wonderment and simplicity? Well, I like to call it the What's a Who's -a Thingamajig Mixer Upperer. But most people would probably call it a random item generator. But not just your standard variety, this is kind of a super powered version. Let's go work on gathering some supplies and I'll explain more as we go. The reason I came up with this design is because I've got about 40 different items that I need to send through that represent different crazy experiments I want to try, one of which is today. Ooh, it's some of that elusive floating magical gravel. So about this machine. As I mentioned earlier, it expands the capabilities of a dropper. A dropper is crafted by using seven cobblestone and one piece of redstone. It holds up to nine items and it looks very happy. Okay, I think we've got all the gravel we need. So let's keep talking about this while we go and find ourselves a bit of sand to dig up. Now, I'm anticipating there's gonna be some of you that say, well, Emmy, why not just use a chest with a hopper into the dropper? Oh my gosh, there are a lot of mobs over here. Okay, I'm so sorry, hold that thought. I'm gonna go find some place to sleep so that we can carry on and not be afraid of dying. Okay, that is so much better. Is it just me or is there a band of bunnies starting to form around me? Suspicious. So we were talking about the chest and the hopper and the dropper and why that doesn't work for our situation. As soon as you start putting items in the chest, it funnels down and fills up the dropper. Any items you add after that are stuck until the ones in front of it are gone. And that is not what we want. With the machine we're just about to build, we can cycle through as many items as we want and every single one of them has an equal chance of being selected. The only thing we have left to do is to make some white concrete and then we can start building our what's a hoozy thingamajig mixer upperer. Okay, fine, call it a random item generator if you must. Now that we've gathered all our supplies, it's time to actually build this thing. This is actually a really simple build and it uses very limited supplies. There are actually a couple of alternative ones that I came up with since this design. And if you're interested in seeing those, then hit the like button and let me know in the comments. So this design uses a bubble column in order to help circulate all of the items before they end up going into the dropper. Since we have to do some of the mechanics down below, we will add the water at the very end. The only real mechanics you need for this build are two droppers, two observers, one sticky piston, and a sprinkling of redstone dust. And of course, a bunch of hoppers. Once everything's put together, you'll see this is actually a really easy build to do and to understand. Now that we've got the water chute portion done, let's go ahead and speed through the rest. And just like that, the machine is done. And oh my gosh, you guys, I am super excited about it. And I'm really anxious to show you how it works. Right in here, we have our dropper, which drops the items into the bubble column. They go down the water stream and then into the hoppers and it circulates through the system. Now, until this lever is pulled again, nothing's gonna land in the dropper. So everything has an equal chance to get in there. It's kind of like, I relate it to musical chairs. When the music's going, everybody has a chance for a chair until the music stops. Now this lever right here, this lever is keeping everything inside of the shulker box or if you had a chest on there so that it's easy to swap out items. But if we wanted to put this into action, you will see these are items that represent all of the different experiments that I want to do on the server for science. <laughs> but if we wanted to send them into the system, we flip that switch. You can see there they go and then we turn the system on. Oh, I love that so much. Any sort of moving parts, I, I love anything like that. I just think it makes the game so much more fun. So you'll see there's nothing in the dropper right now. It's just circulating through until we flip this switch. And now the dropper's gonna fill up 
and those are the items we have to choose from. Whoop! <laughs> I think once we get some blocks in there, we can we can aim those a little bit better. But that is basically how the system runs. Now let's say you wanted to switch to maybe a different set of items or a different set of challenges. All you have to do, turn that on so that it will catch everything in the shulker and you just flush the system out until nothing else comes out right there. We do need to manually take these items out. Boop, there we go. And then everything will be collected nice and tidy in here. It works exactly as I hoped it would. I'm super excited about this. Now we just need to finish the build on the front, make it look nice and pretty, and get our first victim. Mm, I mean, volunteer. Well, what do you know? It is finished. The entire build is done. So the next thing we need to do is head down to the N City Shopping District and see if anybody has signed up on the volunteer board. After I put the machine to the test for the first science experiment, then we're going to come back here and I'm going to show you a couple of ideas I put together for things that you might want to try in your world. All right, let's see if we've got some volunteers. Hopefully somebody signed up. It's been up for a couple of days now and it's hiding right back here behind this pillar. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Oh, I'm very happy to see we've got some volunteers. I know that Ode is online, so I'm going to see if I can contact him and have him meet us over at the community center where I have set up an office for the research lab. Man, Zinc did such a gorgeous job on this build. I am so excited to see what experiment he ends up getting and just as excited for you guys to see the crazy things we have planned. We have arrived at the office and now we just have to wait for Oda to arrive so we can finalize the paperwork. Dedicated Institute for Experiments. Oh, hi, Research Lab. Well, hello, Oda. I would like to welcome you to the Dedicated Institute for Experiments Research Lab Division. Excuse me, sir. Could you hold it down a little bit? We're in a meeting. What? We're in a meeting. Who are you greeting? <laughs> got a, just, a, you know, a little bit of fine print. Uh, I've got a little waiver that I need you to sign. It's pretty much just that, you know, standard legal mumbo jumbo stuff. You, yeah, I mean, whoever reads those uh, those user agreements anyway, right? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, yeah. What's, where do I sign? Let's okay, uh, just at the very last page. Uh, we're going to go ahead and mm -hmm. get that notarized, and then we can proceed with the next step. So, uh, hi, uh, <laughs> we needed a, uh, a document notarized here. Okay. I do hereby and wherefore art thou till death do us part. Just, just legal mumbo jumbo. It is. It's just, it's, you know, we have, to, we have to cross our I's and dot our T's or something like that. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, consider this notarized. Just a few questions, though, on this uh, before we uh, hand this back. Khakis or jeans? Oh, jeans every day. So much more comfortable. Got it. Okay, notarized. Oh, thank you. Next. You know, it looks pretty safe and legit, doesn't it? I don't see anything wrong with yeah. this. Yeah, <laughs> totally not a place anyone would want to sign no, up to no, come in No, no, this is here. a professional environment here. <laughs> here, come on, come on in. Okay, don't mind these guys. They're uh, they're nothing to be concerned with. It's Bob and Stan. Oh my. They, they uh, participated in one of our previous experiments, and they're doing fine. They're doing just just fine. What did I get myself into? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so behold, this is where the magic happens. If you flip this lever, that will turn the machine on. Okay, now you, you can see the items will start to cycle through our, our generator machine here. Okay, all right. And as soon as you are ready, go ahead and flip that lever and stop the machine. And then you will hit the button and you will see what your fate is. So go ahead and hit that button when you're ready. Okay, um, should I be scared? No, 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 it's perfectly <laughs> safe. We are a professional, okay. we are a professional institution <laughs> here. There's nothing, nothing to okay, worry about. Okay, um, all right, so just press this button, huh? There we go. Oh, 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 oh composter. Oh, dear. Oh. What? Uh, uh, nothing. I mean, composters are <laughs> yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's fine. It's good. There's, you're fine. It's, it's fine. <laughs> you're, 
You're going to be okay. I've never been afraid of a composter <laughs> before right now. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I you know, might have a, a few things that we need to get ready first and everything. So uh, if, okay. you, if you want to give me the composter... Not that, you know, not that I'm there afraid anything's going to happen to it or anything, but just so I can hold on to this for <laughs> safekeeping and, you know, we're going to remember what you're doing and everything. I'm going to set it over here by the, by the spawn bed. Um, so that's all we really need to worry about for now. And as soon as we are ready and we've made your appointment, then I'll have my people contact your people and we shall meet up again. I did want to remember to tell you, that when we do actually, you know, make your appointment and you do your experiment, you, you might, you might want to travel lightly. I mean, there's, you know, it's like any sort of <laughs> adventure you go on. There's really no need to carry any extra valuables or anything like that. You know, just, just travel nice and nice okay, and light. Okay, I should, I should probably have read the no, fine print on no, that no, waiver a little fine. bit better. It's fine. Huh? You'll be fine. No, trust me. <laughs> trust me. Um. You're in good hands. Oh. Did, did you have any other questions or concerns? No. Maybe not I mean, concerns, but questions. Concerns? That yes, concerning. lots of concerns. <laughs> but um, I think I I think I might have signed away my right to uh, question those concerns. Yeah, you're pretty you're pretty much you're a done deal. All right. Well, thank you. Thanks for stopping by. Bye. Bye. So now I've got to work on getting a few things ready for these challenges. And you know, while I was doing the work, I was kind of thinking, you know, how dare Oda? He kind of implied that I didn't know what I was doing and that we're not a professional organization. Now, obviously, any kind of institution that does formal research, they've got to know what they're doing, right? I mean, how dare he imply that I am anything less than professional? I hold myself to the utmost standards of integrity, efficiency, and impeccable professionalism. So I'm gonna use this opportunity to really let all those attributes shine because I'm sure the others will be watching to see what kind of organization I've got going on over here. And I certainly wanna make sure we've got plenty of volunteers. So I'm gonna take this opportunity to put my best foot forward and show them what I'm made of. I mean, I've got so many questions and so many experiments that I want to do, and I, I just don't want people to be turned away thinking that we're not professional. But anyway, I suppose I better clean up this mess and get back to work so I can get things ready and call Oda back over to the research lab. I hope you're sorry for what you've done. Hello. Hey, hello, Oda. Awesome. Are How you? Are you? I am fantastic. Are you ready to partake? Yeah. I. Yep. I packed light, like you said, just the important things: a light snack, yeah, some yeah. transportation, and of course, you know, the every important fly. <laughs> you never know when that might come in handy. All right. Yeah. Come with me, and All right. we will come right in here. Uh, we do have a a few. Uh, Happy Your birthday! <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, Surprise. it's probably not his birthday. Whoops. <laughs> Who pooped a pork chop already? <laughs> here, let's let's come through here. Oops, let me for dramatic effect. Let me shut this door. Okay. Uh, I didn't realize science had an audience. This is interesting. Yeah, we okay. you know just uh, some some observers. Oh, okay. All we this are the for science. For science. For science. For science. For science. <laughs> As you may or may not know, Oda selected the composter for his experiment. Ooh. Yes, the composter. Yep. Mm -hmm. Composter. Now, it has been claimed that the composter can keep you safe from mobs like a little hideout. Yes, yes. So we're going to test to see if that is still relevant in today's version and if it protects you against the big boy mobs because I don't think that has ever been tested. So this is going to be a four-part challenge to see how Oda holds up. Oh. Are you ready, Oda? Okay. Good luck, man. Yeah, I've, got, yeah. um, I've got a lot riding on this. All right. So you just riding rest, on this. okay? Riding, and... just riding what? what? <laughs> Sorry. Hey, just... Good luck. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Come right this way. One at all. Oh, this is ominous. No, no. <laughs> no, no. It's just, it's just, you know, decorative. I like green. Okay, so we're going to come right down this little waterway here. You know, maybe, maybe, maybe happy colors would be a, would be a choice. Maybe. In the oh, wow. Oh, Ooh. my gosh. I won. First challenge, which is getting to the science. <laughs> The viewing audience has a nice little area right over here. Ooh. There are snacks oh. and, and beverages provided. I suggest you Ooh. wait on the beverages until later. I'll let you know when, when to partake. Okay. You and I, Oda, we're not going to sit in these comfy seats. No, no, no we're no, going to no. come down here, my friend. That's right. Oh, this is even scarier because there's no big oh, zombies. No. Did you get yourself a cookie? 
No, 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 no. You're fine. I'm real sorry about the uh, snow here, but we'll get rid of that in a second. Yeah, it's a little chilly here without all my armor on. Yeah. <laughs> Is he sleeping on the job down there? Oh, oh what? Bit. What? Okay. Just a little bit. Okay, so Oda, I'm gonna let you go ahead and get in ahead of time there. Oh my! This feels really yeah. scary. Yeah, no, <laughs> it's no, just no, a composter, and this is it's really fine. scary. They, they say it's fine. I'm gonna have you hop in. We'll wait to have you shut that the door until the uh -oh. friends come uh -oh. over. Okay. Oh, I th oh, I think the skeletons. Oh, okay, the skeletons toast. So there's one less. I love. There's this. one less for you. <laughs> this experiment is now flawed. Why are you holding a totem? It's my teddy bear. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oops. Oh, I'll leave that last one. Good luck, buddy. Um, I'm in the box. I can't see anything but the box. Oh. Look at that. I can hear the zombies. Hey, this is going well. That's Actually, it really yeah. is. They are. Look oh. at look at that. It's worked fantastically. Completely ignoring him. Does that mean? Oh, does it mean well. I succeeded? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nothing to it. Yeah. Good job. All right. This is awesome. I like this. I say size. round this one's is... looking pretty good. Hey, hey. I got out of the box. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Great. Oh no. Oh no. For science. For science. <laughs> <laughs> Despite the fact that I did play a bit of a dirty trick on Oda knowing his fate when he exited the composter, I would say that round one was a definite success. It did great against standard mobs, but now it's time to dig a little bit deeper and see how it does against the <laughs> warden. And, uh... No, no, it's fine. It's not not a big deal. Oh, uh, yeah, go ahead and I go ahead. Oh, and that can't be good. Down and. <laughs> I'm just gonna slowly back away. Oh dear. Uh, I, I can't even see to get out of here. Let me know. Oh, how this it's is going. creepy. Oda, get in that composter. It's, it's really dark. Really dark. Wait, hold on. Oh, okay. Yeah, I hear him. I got I hear Oh, God. Him. I hear something. Oh, hear oh no. Really oh, no. <laughs> Emmy might want to go. Oh, no, no. Can you no, see Emmy? There's blackness up there, but I'm, I'm just gonna think invisible thoughts. Can he smell me? He's sniffing. I Come declare on, invisibility. You showered this week, right? <laughs> Come on, Oda. Tell I me you showered. So. Uh, earlier this week, yes. Oh, his hand just went through the box. Just a little love tap. <laughs> oh my God. Don't hate oh, him. Hand. Oh, 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 no, oh, no. oh, that he is creepy you. looking. Oh, oh, he oh, oh darn. Boy. He mad. He's working. He, oh he knows God. you're there. I'm not sure if that's my heartbeat or the warden's. This is awesome. Dude, he is on top of oh, you. Oh, like, that oh. was awesome. That was less than awesome. <laughs> oh. How many hearts oh, did that? No. Oh, oh. 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 That, that was all oh, of them. No. It worked yeah. for a while. Dang it. For science. For, for science. science. <laughs> <laughs> That's interesting. You can't do melee on him through the bucket. Uh-uh. That was but cool. But he also didn't make any noise, so that's probably why. He only smelled him. Uh-huh. Okay, now go in there and finish him off, Oda, yeah, so we, we don't have to. Treat now, go ahead. Oh, <laughs> oh, come on. What could possibly go wrong, she says. See ya. What, could, what could possibly go wrong? With the warden under our belt, it's time for us to move on to the next leg of our journey, which is to see how the hey. composter will do against the wither. I've never fought a wither in my life. Oh, this no, is going to no, hurt. No, no, this is going to hurt. This is going to hurt. Don't shoot him, oh. guys. Oh, oh, interesting. Uh, I, I yeah, live, I but you. I do not okay. have a box anymore. It, it, it killed the box, one? but... Right. There's another one in this uh, shulker back here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's diamonds behind them. <sighs> there you go. I'm in it. I'm in it. All right, all right. For science. For science. For science. See the wither does. Hold on, there's a diamond <laughs> over here. I'm just going to pick this up. There's, yeah, don't, don't, yeah, don't shoot him. Let's see what... So is he not seeing me? I mean, that is the <clears throat> idea of the science experiment, right? He... <laughs> Wait, right. guys, we're not attacking him either, are we? That is a mm -hmm. very okay. tough piece of blue wool. Not to my knowledge, I haven't swung anything yet. Oh, oh I can hear it exploding what around me. What is he shooting at? He wants the diamonds too, apparently. <laughs> Wait. Here's something maybe. Right, let's give him a no, there's hits. nothing back there. <laughs> it's completely empty back there. That's what probably why. Who now? did that? Who did that? Uh, He's just going up. Um, there's, yeah, that's... Uh, ah! There he goes. Hey, okay. I'm the one holding oh, this. Oh, there he goes. Ah! 
<laughs> oh, he blew up my box. Oh, you exploded the box. <laughs> oh, I have the box. I need. I need the lid. It's right above you still. <laughs> oh. Ah. Uh, let's oh, see. Oh, Damn it. Is right the there. ceiling? Ooh, the I'm ceiling is too low. I can't. <laughs> oh, oh go. crud. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. That's okay. No, no problem. No problem. Oh my gosh. I'm in the box, but I'm also in the ground. <laughs> Who got the head? I did. It was an accident. Oh. Done. He's dead. Done. Oh, that Jittery was easy. here. Good job. He didn't really aggro on him so until I was to, like, he was punch up the trap door to move it, and like he got me while I was doing that. <laughs> the fourth and final phase of the composter experiment comes by way of the raid farm. Will the composter hold up to all the different Wait, waves that a raid can throw at it? We're about to find out. Doesn't protect you. <laughs> <laughs> oh right the okay well thanks for that it's a bloodbath Oda how you doing all my buddy? stuff is over there I'm Come doing wait, great wait can we pick up armor <laughs> yeah Oda's okay yeah, yeah. Oh, my it stuff is in the box though okay oh oh captain let 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 them let them go over there oh I'm oh, sorry I'll leave you alone oh he's coming for you jittery oh oh is no, he he just ran over top You're, he's going for he's going for captain he's going he's going for captain Run, Cap, run! Wait. I'll shoot him. So as long as they don't see okay. us go in the and buckets, down. we're fine. Okay, here we go. Oh. He can't get you. He can't oh. get you. Oh, he's getting he's you. He's hitting me. He's hitting he's me. He's getting you. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. Okay, run, Jittery, okay. Run. <laughs> I'm going to die. I'm going to die. You are. Oh. Oh, Cap got him. Good job, Cap. Oh, right behind us. Woohoo. Oh boy. Let's see what the Vex is doing. Mm -hmm. I'm down to half a heart. Oh. Someone pray for me. Hurry. Pray. Oh, he's Captain like. Hit me. He like warped Ooh, into a block. Good job, Cap. <laughs> Someone shot that arrow. Thank you. I'll be darned. Okay. I think these are working, <laughs> you guys. Right. Okay. Aw, he didn't they drop me once. Head. Oh, Jittery. Jittery, you literally <laughs> got an arrow in your eye. I just heard That's a Vex. That's a terrible place for now. He was right yeah. next to you, Oda. Like, he was like right at your composter. Uh huh. <laughs> Oh, Oda doesn't even have a blemish. Oh, okay. yeah, they're I, going through I, and hittING me. I just saw they are a hitting Vex. You uh, no, huh? I saw like a yeah. Vex go through my box. But we won the raid, him. and not a scratch on Oda. Me. Is everything gone? Oh, um, yeah. oh there's, still, what did you say? there's still a couple of Vexes up there. Be careful. <laughs> Cheater. For science. For, For science. science. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Oda. Oh. Ping pong. Our our arrowhead <laughs> shot yeah. for science. Yeah, for science. How interesting, science. though. I mean, that was that was actually that really was cool. cool. Yeah. Got all your stuff. I'm sorry, Oda. I just couldn't help okay, myself. I mean, after you made it through without even yeah. a scratch on you, I just figured it was a an appropriate ending. Captain, Forgive you want your me. Axe back? <laughs> oh yeah, okay, thank you. you. I don't. I don't really have anything prepared. I just feel like there should be, you know, an official closing to this. So hope. Okay. For science! For science! For science! For science! Oh. We should take a picture in front of the composters. <laughs> absolutely. Oda, I, I have to commend you. You did an absolutely phenomenal job. I appreciate you, you know, giving your time, talents, and body for science. Why, thank you. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, much appreciated. I hope you will sign up again, and I, and I hope the same goes for the rest of you, that you will be willing to volunteer for some future experiments. We're ready to do science, Emmy. Heck yeah. All right. For science on three? Yes. Wait, are we high five or what do we do? Of course it would rain. <laughs> yeah! Okay. Oh. Okay. 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 For science on yes. three. One, One two, two, three. three. For, for science! science! Yes. That first experiment was amazing, and I'm so glad we did that. It actually was extremely interesting. So, as promised, I have put together a selection of various ideas that you could use with this machine. And of course, please know that you are more than welcome to subscribe and follow along because we will be doing more and more crazy experiments on here and you are more than welcome to copy the same experiments that we do, use them in your own worlds. Maybe you'll even find some variations or have some different results and actually that'd be really fun and I'd love to hear about it. But some of the ideas include a builder's challenge where whichever block you select, either you have to build primarily with that block or maybe, you know, 30% of the build has to be with that block. But 
You know, how much fun would that be? Because you can put in some really weird ones that you wouldn't normally build with, and it would kind of force you out of your comfort zone. A scavenger hunt. I actually really like this idea. You could either work in teams, or you could be versus another player. And whichever item you pick, you've got to go out and see if you can find it within a certain amount of time, or maybe see who gets back first with the item. You know, it's, it's limited only by your very own imagination. The predictable PvP challenge, but I thought, oh my gosh, this would actually be a lot of fun because you could put some really weird things in there, like imagine trying to fight somebody with a wooden sword versus somebody with a lava bucket. Yeah, I mean, you could just make it really crazy and fun. Come on, you've got to love the fishing rod. That would actually be hysterical. I mean, the whole object of it is to have fun. I mean, some of those things are so stupid that it would just be really silly fun. And I personally love stuff like that. This is definitely a fantastic way to shake things up in your world, beat the boredom, put a little bit of fun and unpredictability into it. And it's just a really cool build to do. And I really hope you find it useful. So until next time, this is Emmy. I love you guys and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.